everyone, my name is Palacet Moon and welcome back to Hermitcraft Season 10, Episode 11. Oh boy, it looks like it's time, time to get our permit, but it's open on April Fool's and that makes me really sus. Alright, alright, let's see what happens. The permit office is over towards the shopping district and fingers crossed uh, we can get what we need today. Is that it? Who's that? That scar going in the same direction. All right, where is it? Somewhere out there it is. Oh gosh, that's just doom and gloom looking at this thing. Hey! <laughs> don't don't look over in the parking lot. It's fine. It's fine. Knock knock. Turn the lights on. Hello, valued Hello. customers. Go How can I help you today? Wait, is yep. this? Oh, Please. sorry. Yeah, no, this door is actually open today. Oh, it's what? open. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, this, do this door's working today. Ah, oh, thank you very oh, much. Oh, sorry. Oh, um. Oh. Right, how can I Thanks. help you? I would like a permit, please, for the stamps. You promised okay, me one. Right, well, Thank you. Yes. Yep, here we go. So you need form MJYAAFK06, form for the creation of permit. I just need you <laughs> to fill this out. And why don't, you, yeah, why don't you read that out and just fill that out? It's only one page. Oh, thank you very much. Okay, form MJYAAFK06, form for the creation of a new permit. What would you like to create a permit for? Uh, this, this, uh, stamps. 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 Is it April 1st? Yes, indeed it is. Uh, signed. Uh, post office pillow. Yeah, pillow. Yeah, there we go. Signed. Yep. Yep. Signing closed. Done. There we go. Permit. Signed. Wonderful. Thank you. And here's your permit. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait, just like, just like that? Yeah. <laughs> just, just like that? Special. That's it? Special. You read the sign. Oh my gosh. Heck yeah. Wait, can I get more? Can I get more permits just like that too? What? What do you, well, you're gonna have to fill out another form. Oh yeah, I could, I, I, I can do that. Do you, you got some, uh, got some chorus flowers and some endstone available by chance? Oh, that's a different form. Hey, oh, Scar, why don't nice. I help you out? Okay. Oh, oh yes. Am I, am I ready? Mm. Am I ready? Yep. What do you need, buddy? <sighs> Hello. You fill, filled out that form. Mr. I have. I, I went to great lengths. I want the permit office to know that this great is lengths. a complete and true form. It's not been notarized. <laughs> no, no, I signed it. It's, it's been. Been signed. It's not been notarized. Oh. But that's okay because we don't need them notarized today. <gasps> I just oh, need to admit. I just need oh, to check. Oh, okay. Oh, the oh. only relevant question is the first one. So here we no, go. No, they're all relevant. <laughs> I worked hard on them. The first, I don't even need to see the answers. Right. So here you go. Here is your permit for all the mobs. Wait. Nope. Give that back. That's oh. not true. I need that okay, back. Okay. Okay. That's back, back to you. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Because you've created the permit, but actually, I need. For something like this, you yeah. need to exchange of equal value the permits. The the stamps is a special case as it's a custom item specifically for the post office, Heck but yeah. this is something that you sell. So I'm going to need you to exchange something that you've got in your permit pouch for this one, which is another form that I need you to okay, fill out. Okay, right I have now. this. I have this. Uh, it's very valuable. It needs to be permits. Okay. Um, I don't have any permits on me. Okay, well, you're gonna have to go and get those. <laughs> I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Jeez. I thought the door was open. Oh. It is on the other okay. side. <laughs> okay, yeah, there, we go. there we go. I'm hoping once I've given you two what you need, that'll be the permit office can go on uh, vacation for probably another year. Uh, yeah, wait, hold on. So, can I get my other permits while we're here and he's going to get his stuff? You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. A year. I can't wait a year for those permits. Let me write mate. a form. <laughs> Let me write a quick form. Oh, he's working today. Let's go. Yeah. There you go. Just fill that like out. That. Oh, that was quick. Yeah, fill that <laughs> out. Wait, 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 wait. What do you want? <laughs> Just like that, eh? <laughs> and so permit and chorus <laughs> flowers. Thanks. <laughs> there you go. Right. All right, you want endstone permit chorus flowers. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh, you cannot have either of those what? without exchanging them. Uh, you I can't didn't... just, you can't, you, you, got, you gotta, you gotta form a permit and you gotta go through the same process as Scar here. Oh. You need to exchange them because uh -huh. there's only a few things that haven't. I could attach chorus flowers to some sort of other end permit if there is one. Well, I've got a certain purple permit. Eh? That would work. Eh? But endstone, eh? endstone is a permit on its own and for something like that, I'd need to put it up for uh, auction. At this wretched permit auction. office. Okay, I'll let him All go right. first. We'll discuss this later. All right, can I can I join the queue here? Yeah, you go yeah, in. So on. you go let's, in. You've been waiting long enough. So right, pop in here and uh, let's see. So th this 
let's separate here. So this is the all the mobs. So you put in your permits on the left. That's that's a beat up stamp. That's a rare stamp. Nope. <laughs> oh, um, turn around, Pearl. Wait, wait, hold on a He's second. Turn around, Pearl. Hold turn on. around, Pearl. You turn don't around, have, Pearl. You don't have the permit to trade those. Excuse me. It was a gift from Etho. It was a gift from Etho. <sighs> That's not an official Come trade. on, Scout. It's permits for permits it here. It's an official one. <laughs> We're not the stamp office. We're the permit office. Come on. Right, there you so, go. All the mobs for the three glass. I got it. You you tell me I got it. It's oh. April 1st. It's everyone's birthday. Wow. Oh. Dude. It's, it's done, Pearl. You finally All did it. All the work. <laughs> I did. Dude. I'm so happy. Congratulations, buddy. Oh, I don't even know what to do now. I, I All I've been focused on is getting these mobs, and now I'm like... Oh, what do I do now? Well, you, uh, you go well, do your mob thing. It's as simple, easy as that. Yeah. What, what do I do with these glass permits now? <laughs> Have fun. I'll have them. <laughs> oh, Wrong dang door, it. Scar. Other one, yeah. buddy. <laughs> that, that's it. Other one. You got it. Yeah. I, I yeah. ran out of rockets. Well, Hold that's on. awkward. Hold on. I got you. Hold on. Here you go. Here you go. Go fly away. <laughs> go buy some more Come rockets. Come fly with go me. Go do your mobs. Come fly with Oh. <laughs> not my fault. I did not <laughs> give him that. Let it be known. Ooh, free permits though. You want to give me those permits and uh, yeah. I, I guess I'll put them yeah, I'll put them in lost and found. Yeah, there you go. And then he can f he can fill out a form to collect those. <laughs> oh no, I kind of feel bad for him though. Maybe I should have held on to them. I wouldn't mind going to get my permits to do that uh, combination for the um, chor uh, chorus flower? Oh, you know what? I don't want gray terracotta anyway. What if I trade that for the end stone? Or magenta wool, I don't care about that either. My steam's permit, oh lovely. Okay, I'm just gonna grab everything just in case. But there's my fable purpose sandwich. Sam, uh, Stamus? Stamus? it? Stamp permit, permit. <laughs> Fantastic, right, bring loops back. Hopefully get ourselves a nice combined permit to use in the shopping district. Ah, the doom and gloom. So, Scar. Yes. Your permits have been submitted to Lost and Found, which requires you to fill out some forms. <laughs> okay. Ooh. And as far as I'm concerned, April Fool's is over. You've had your permits worth out of me. Oh. But, it, it, but it's still permit time. So but I'm going to have to ask you to please oh. hold. No. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a bop, though. Right, Pearl, how can I help you? That, ooh, I get to jam wait, wait, to the this, whole this, music? This, one, this line's just opened. Ah, oh, brilliant. All right, I'd like to uh, add my add that end permit to my per per permit, please. Okie doke, no problem. There we go. Ooh. Easy as that. All done. Oh, absolutely brilliant. Can I can I do a trade for that endstone one by chance? Yep. Uh, what have you got? I got magenta wool and grey terracotta. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, endstone is really. Why do you want endstone? Because it goes with purple and chorus fruit. Right. Okay. Uh, yeah. You see? Yeah. I, I, okay. <laughs> the permit office does not understand my logic, apparently. You can only see my face right now. I can see it. There's I'm glass between us. <laughs> it's a grimace. What? It's fine, Scar. Get to drive to some good music, man. Stop that. <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs> this is great. I want this on a track. Give me a single. Please leave a review in the chat of your experience. Oh, I, do I have to do it right now? Or can I do it in two days' time? No, no, you do, do, do it afterwards. All right, so Heck Endstone. Yeah. I'll take either the wool or the terracotta. Ooh, or the terracotta. Have the terracotta. I don't want that. Okay, there we go. And there's oh, your Endstone. Brilliant. Just like that. Thank you very much, sir. Yep. That's it. Okay. I'm all done. I do have to watch this fold out, unfold, though. This is very important. <laughs> Right, I'm gonna need to make a, a new form for you, but I think it's gonna have to wait till tomorrow because our time up, our time is done here. No, there's oh. more time. No, Scar, I'm afraid. 
tell him. There's no time. Tell him, Pearl, oh. there's more time. I mean, sir, I mean, you've been absolutely wonderful. If you could just give this poor man some time. He's been through so much, you know. He's been through yes. the dirt, the grub, the grime. He's crawling through the mud. He'd really love his permits back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yay! Oh, thank you, Let's go. Can we uh, turn the music off? Oh, thank you. Oh. Thank just you. for today. <laughs> just for today. Oh, look at them. Look at them. Oh, Everybody God, wins. Mom's yeah, okay. What can Christmas. I do for, for that terracotta you gave uh, um, Pearl? <laughs> or she gave you. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. I really want to close. April 1st is our busiest day of the year. <laughs> Block the door, Pearl. I don't have the blocks. Well, you've got, just stand you want... in front of it. Okay, so uh, here's the thing. With the with the permits that the permit office is holding, they're in limbo. They are, they belong to nobody. Okay, so, okay. if people want them, they can either exchange equal value for them, or I can post them as available, and people can submit their name to collect. I'd like to submit my name to collect for that terracotta permit. Yeah, but there's a whole, you know, I'm gonna have to put it up on a board and give everyone on the server ample opportunity to also submit. Fine, that's fine, that's fine. I would also like to submit to collect. Thank you. You okay. gave it up. <laughs> I didn't know it was free free up for grabs. <laughs> oh, it won't be it won't be free. Oh. Alright. There you go. We're all done here. Yay! Oh, Such thank a... you, Mr. Permit Office. <laughs> thank you. This I'm gonna say was a more pleasant experience than the permit office that I've dealt with in real life recently. Well, so I'm not you doing my a... job very well. This is this is over. This niceness, right? Special day, special one day red tape removal is done. I thought I was, I thought I was giving him a compliment. <laughs> I don't think he likes to work. There now that there's evidence done. of it. <laughs> I think I've upset him. Go on fishing forever. Never fishing again. Forever. Well, if this was any scar, if this was any other day, those permits would be in that lost and found for three months. I'm leaving. Ooh, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Okay, yeah, I think oh it's time God. to go. Time to go. Time Don't to go, die. time to go. Use the right rockets this time. I had a horrible experience. Goodbye, I want to die. Day. Thank you, sir. You've been wonderful. Don't, no, don't, don't tell him that. I mean, well, to be honest, Scott, to, to be honest, I, I had nothing but good, good experiences in there. He gave me everything I needed. No, but you're supposed to say you had a bad experience because apparently he doesn't want to work. Oh, you're right, actually. Maybe I should say that in chat as my review. There we go. Perfect. That's what he wanted, right? <laughs> That's what he wanted, yeah? <laughs> Just to make yep. sure nobody would want to go to the permit office so he doesn't have to do any work, yeah? <laughs> yep, that's true. There we go. You know, for all the times that people said the permit office was really difficult and painful to go to, <laughs> we sure had an easy time, and now we've officially got our stamp permit, which, at least in my opinion, I kind of feel like we didn't really need. Apparently, we're, we're kind of a government organization, right? Why do we need a permit to sell those kinds of things? Without the stamps, there's no mailboxes. Without the mailboxes, there's no mail. Without the mail, there's no communication. Well, of course, there is communication, but you know what I mean. Anyway, regardless of that, we now have the stamp permit, and that is now basically officially out of the way. It's been breathing down our necks for a little while now, and it's time to get this thing stuck in the post office. And there's a few places we can put it, but you know what? I'm thinking of putting this proudly on display right here, and that lets everybody know that we are indeed supported by the permit office for our business. Made the item frame invisible, and that is absolutely stunning. Oh, I love it. With the whole permit shenanigan out of the way, it is time to get on back to business of where we left off the last episode. Would you just check out those little sniffer noses poking through the door? This is indeed the place that I want to give you all an update for, and they're obviously coming to say hi, because my gosh, that's a lot of noses. Let's pop back in here, and I'll give you guys a bit of an update as to what I've done. I've indeed, of course, as you can see straight away, I've bred a few extra sniffers in there, so that bunch should cover this ground quite nicely. I did change some of the ground to grass as well, because the moths didn't seem super efficient in what they were sniffing up. There is a second alley in here somewhere as well to cover the second type of seed, if we can find him. Little dude. Oh, there he is. Perfect. There we go. We've got both of them now to cover the two different types. And unlike last time, I think I'm only going to have two alleys because they should cover this area just fine with the rate that they actually pull up things out of the ground. And you might also notice a certain tango is overlooking the farm for us. As per Etho's advice, I stuck the tango head on the note 
note block here and that silences it just nicely. It had to be a player head, not a mob head, otherwise it would be making a lot of noise. And well, I had two options. I had my head or I had Tango's head to use. And I think we all know uh, who is essentially the better option out of the two there. So that is looking wonderful. Now going back here, I'll show you the production rate as well. But before I do that, I've, I've, as you can see, I've made a little bit of an upgrade to the underside here. We've got some new lights on the ceiling with the end rods and the beautiful particles coming out of those. And I've just neatened up this corner a little bit and made this a proper little garden with pickles and mossy stuff and drip leaf stuff and azalea stuff and my favorite flower bush. But overall, I think this is looks so much more crazier in here. And you know what? I'm basically accepting the fact that with solar punk, not everything has to be bright. With light comes darkness in all aspects. You're going to have shadow in certain areas and some areas are just going to be a little bit grungier. But I'm going to try and keep in nature as much as I can. But I think I'm a lot happier in here with how much cleaner it is. Let's hop in here because I've also done a bit of interior stuff. Well, not very much. I've just added some mushrooms, as you can see, and changed up the floor a bit, added a little table. We got some glow lichen on the windows for a very kind of overtaken nature feeling and I've also compacted the redstone a little bit. It used to come out in this direction and I've just flipped it around so it does a nice 180 and it keeps it all in this little room out the back and I've also been doing a little bit of AFKing here at it and we now have quite a few stacks of the beautiful pitcher plods Pitcher plods? Pods and torch flower seeds. And now that we have the seeds, we're gonna have to grow these things because we're gonna sell them, right? So let's make ourselves a little nice cozy space to get these things actually producing. A little bit of dirt, some basic trap doors, make sure we got our hoe, gonna need some water. And I'm gonna need to run this farm a little bit more to get some bones, but let's just grab that for now. And you know what? I think the best place to actually be growing these things is gonna be in the in the section of the building that is right next to the sniffer farm, and that's this glass area right here that we made last episode. One of the main discussions in the comments of the previous episode was what this building is actually called. I know Etho and I talked about calling this an atrium, and in a way it kind of is an atrium. It very much is a giant glass room. And it does have the option to have some plants in it, but you guys are also talking about like arboretums and all that kind of stuff. But one kind of comment, or at least several of them that mentions the one type of thing really stood out to me. And that was a solarium. Solarium? Solarium? I don't know which way around it's spoken, but that was pretty cool. And in general, I think that definition, it matches the theme and the vibe of the building so, so well. So that's what we're going to call it. But either way, the farm would fit absolutely brilliantly in this space. And I think for now, we're actually just going to chuck it down on this lower part here. Hook in a little bit of dirt. We'll give ourselves some kind of water sources right here as well. Boop. Chuck in the spruce trap doors along the edges just to get rid of the dirt lip. Do a bit of tilling, good old farmland. And then we'll chuck our pitcher pods in. Hey, there we go. There is the achievement and get these lovely things growing. Oh, and including the torch flowers. I don't really like torch flowers as much, but we need both of them. Look at that. Isn't that just cute? And if we use a bit of bone meal on one of them, at least we can get one of these in our inventory. Look at it. Isn't that a beautiful flower? I really do love pitcher pods. They're gorgeous. But essentially what I will need to do is grow a whole bunch of these so we can actually finally set up our starter shop that we need to make. But that's going to take a while and I'm not going to bore you with that. So we'll come back to this later. One of the biggest things that we do need to consider that is not even related to the sniffer stuff is that our permit is for all the dyes and flowers. And let's just say um, my stores of flowers aren't exactly amazing. My spore blossoms, because I've also got the spore blossom permit, is amazing. And I'm going to include that in my shop. But everything else is looking pretty sad. I could absolutely go out and collect a bunch of those things and do it manually. But I think there's a certain someone on the server that I think we can actually strike a deal with. Someone that might have a flower farm. Someone that's going to save me a lot of manual time collecting these things. And someone who's going to save me some time making those gigantic farms by myself. So let's go see if this certain someone is potentially up for a deal. They've certainly been hitting at it for a while, so uh, let's go take a little bit of a visit. <laughs> I got stuck. Hello. Oh, wait, 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 wait. hold on, hold on. There he is. There he is. There he is. There he is. Hello, my lady. Hi. It's <laughs> just so loud. Oh it's my god. Oh, there you go. You've got one as well. What's she complaining about? <laughs> I got a toots. You 
got Hi, a tooth. This one's an ultra big tooth. I got a tooth. You got a tooth. <laughs> my, mine, is, mine is not as cool as yours. <laughs> it's okay. Yours is cool amazing. Thing. I know. What? Can... Is that like a vanilla one? It oh, doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's, Love it. It's, it's fine. It's fine. You can hear my bells from five kilometers away. It's all right. <laughs> so, so loud. <laughs> what brings you to the <sighs> shopping district today? Well, I've heard a certain somebody has a certain farm that I'm particularly interested in, and particularly along the plant genre. Like these things. Ooh, oh yeah, leave that there. I, I, oh, that's no, beautiful. That's yeah, fine. I do have, but I don't have those though. I don't have those. No, no, leave it. I don't, I don't have those. Yeah, but you have everything uh, else, right? You've got a farm that does everything else, yeah? That's, that's what I'm interested well, in. Would you like to make a deal, sir? Please. Yes. Please. I, please help I'm, me. I'm kind of happy because I was <laughs> counting my profits earlier and I'm not making any diamonds, Pearl. Well, what is no Stack diamonds? Stack of diamonds. Stack. Two weeks. I've been grinding day in and day out for 64 diamonds. 71, to, to be precise. Mm -hmm. you, you think that's no diamonds, sir? Do, do you want to know how much I've made? Huh? Do you, do you want to know well, how much? Well, more than that, I guess. Huh? I've no, made two, well, well, let me know. sir. I've made two diamonds. I need to make some <laughs> shopping deals. Don't laugh at me. That's just rude. <laughs> oh, you're gonna be the worst business partner. No, okay. No, 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 no. Okay. Wow. No, okay. No, I'll just end the deal right now. Come back. Come back. Come back. Come on. No. Come back. Come back. Come back. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, I will make. I will. I will make this deal. I don't have all the flowers though. That's the thing. I don't have, but I do have the, all the dyes, if that helps you a little bit. Because you get the permit as well, right? Yeah, that helps. I've got all the dyes and flowers, so that definitely helps. I can collect the rest. That's fine. But are you are you up for making a deal? Okay, I can supply the rest of the stuff that you don't have. You can supply the rest of the stuff that I don't have. We can make a shop, and we can make a nice kind of profitable trade, yeah? Yes. What kind I don't of deal? Anymore. What kind of deal are we up for? Do you reckon? What What do you think? Okay, so um, mm, okay, I'm thinking like this. Uh, mm -hmm. You know what? Let's head over to the farm quickly. Okay. I will show where it is, mm -hmm. so we can pretty much just join forces over there. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I w I would use my portal, but some mail system destroyed it, so I can't use it anymore. Mm -hmm. that, that sounds like a you problem, to be honest. <laughs> oh, which way? Uh, this way? Wait. That way? This way? Are you okay. Maybe. Are you telling me you don't know where it's your fine. farm is? This way. Okay. Of course I do. I was just playing with you. This is ah, uh, yeah, sure you were, mate. This way, this. Nah. Uh, this is <laughs> here. This here. Come on. Oh boy, I'm gonna give you a compass for your birthday. <laughs> oh, it's over there. Can you see it? Shoo. Look at that. See, oh, shoo. This, this is exactly yeah. why I did not want to make one of these myself. All right? You're coming in clutch here. Just wash the wither. All Just right. wash the wither. Don't touch the wither. Whatever you do, don't touch the wither. Don't well, touch the wither. How do I know don't not to touch, touch it if I don't the... know where it is? Okay, just don't touch it. Don't move Okay. near this place. I'm not moving. Okay? So as you see... You tell me not to move. You... I'm not moving. No, no, you come on. It's, it's, it's safe okay. over here, Pearl. It's safe <laughs> over here. Don't touch the wither. So... Over here, as you can see, I have all the oh, dice. Oh, look but at the I rainbow. But I won't be able. It's a rainbow. But I won't be able to produce all the all the flowers for you. Mm -hmm. So I got like the the peonies. I got the lilacs. I got the the lilacs. double poopies over here. Poopies. I got the sunflowers. I got the sea pickles and such. Oh. But I don't have all the flowers. Wait, what? So yeah. Sea pickles? What do you mean sea pickles? Yeah, you just get 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 lime dye. Just cook it and lime dime appears. Boom, boom! Who on earth cooks pickles in Minecraft? This is a revelation. I've never seen someone use pickles for lime dye before. Green, yeah, but lime? I, I, I cook my pickles. Oh my god! And over here, okay, oh my god. come over I need here. That whole come, one. Come. <laughs> <laughs> Jump down here, but be careful. Whatever you do, be careful. Okay. Don't touch the wither. Don't mess with the wither. So what what so what what this guy does, one person AFK is in the nether. Uh -huh. The pigmen, zombified pigments come in here, they got shot by the wither, and the wither roses appear oh. in masses. Uh -huh. I've never seen this so, kind of wither rose farm before, and this is really cool. I love the bubbles. Need, That's sick. Neither have I, but it does work, and I'm super happy it does. But don't touch the wither, okay? Don't 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 touch it. Don't, I, whatever I think you, you said, don't touch, touch it. it. I so think yeah, you said touch it. Don't Hello? I'm out of here. If you touch it, okay, <laughs> I'm not touching touch it. it. I'm thinking like this, Pearl. Mm -hmm. That that the dyes I I can provide. Uh -huh. I can provide. I'm a provider. Yeah. For dyes, okay. flowers. I can't I can't be bothered to gather those I I don't have over here. Yeah, I mean I so can get the wanna... rest. That's fine. Mm. I can do that. I mean, if you supply the dyes, that's a huge load off my workload, sir. 
I mean, that's okay if you can do, do it in part. I'm I'm fine with that, I guess. So so what you thinking? Okay, be 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 honest, cause I'm I'm just a poor boy. Nobody <laughs> loves me. <laughs> so, <laughs> hit me. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, like, give me give me give me like a number. A number. Please give me a number. A number. Well, if I'm still collecting a whole bunch of the flowers, but I don't have to worry about the dye. Um, yes. Look, look, I, I can, I'll say, let's do 50-50 on the dyes, right? Because that's going to be a place in my shop. I'm still going to be doing some of the dyes. I can, pitcher plants do cyan dye mm -hmm. and the torch flowers do orange dye. So I can supply those. Okay. 50-50 on that. But the flowers, can, are, you, are you all right with a bit of a one thirty type of thing? Two thirds me, one third you kind of situation, you know? Yeah. If you build the shop, mm -hmm. I'm perfectly fine with that. I can agree to that. Yeah. I can build the shop. Yeah. I can do that. Shake on it. Shake on it. So 50% 50 on the dice uh -huh. and one third on the flowers. In yeah. my favor. Perfect. Yeah. Shake it. In your favor. No, 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 no. I'm I sorry. Okay, okay, I'm no, sorry. Okay. Yeah. No takesy backsies. No takesy backsies. No takesy backsies. Watch the, watch no, the waiter. No, I didn't I'm shake. I didn't shake. You no, punched. Okay, okay, I, okay, I did okay, not okay, shake. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay, let's do toot. Toots. One third. What? And 50% of the dice. For your side, yes. Three, two, two one. Two thirds me. Yep. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, now that's a loud shake if I've ever heard one. <laughs> you got yourself a deal. Heck yeah. Oh, this is great. Amazing. Well then, I think that makes for a yet another successful deal today. Some in the permit office, some for the flower stuff. I think we're going pretty well. And now with basically all of the other dyes and flowers, almost all the flowers uh, covered at this point, I think we can actually get started on our shop. Now, yet again, of course, this is going to be a starter shop. And for all of my starter shops, I actually want to make a bunch of vehicles. Now, I'm not really known for a lot of vehicles. So, you know, we'll just have to try my hardest and hope it turns out okay. But yeah, anyway, what I was thinking, is I want to make some kind of little farm truck for them. I think that would be absolutely adorable. You guys know those kind of like little trucks with the red cabins and then like the wooden little baskets on the back of them? I think that would look quite gorgeous in this spot right here. There's a big open space. And by the way, I do want to mention as well, when it comes to the placement of my trucks, I'm specifically choosing the gaps in between the buildings so they cover up as little as possible of the actual shops. And this farm truck as well, I'm going to stick in this gap and it's also going to be small enough that it will barely cover up anything at all. So to keep up with the theme of things, I say we get building on this shop and waste no more time. And once again, we're gonna go back into a time lapse again. And who would you look at that? It's a little rambly pearl again because these are always far too short to put into that longer form time lapse. So who who would you look at that? We're already done. There we go. I, I just want your opinions, right? I, I would love your, your honest opinion on this. Give me the full critique, you know, be as harsh as you want, but Okay. I mean, you know, this is like a pilot asking a toddler, "What do you, what do you think of my flying All skills?" All opinions matter, no matter what. A pair of eyeballs okay. is a pair of eyeballs, and you go at your own opinions, and I love them. So. Okay, <laughs> I can dig it. All right, go. What do you think of my big red truck? This is your big red truck? Yeah. Okay. It's not hauling right. a Christmas tree, but it's a big red truck. <laughs> it's a flower. Okay. My first, my my first impression is this. Mm -hmm. My very first one. If I made this, I would. it would be the thing that I, I would be like, this is the best thing I've ever made in my entire life. Oh, here's oh. why I say that. Because, well, I can notice instantly it's a truck. I, you wouldn't even be able to be able to tell that it's a truck if, if I made it. No. So no. this is, I like. You need to give yourself this, more credit. This, <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, I'm just very real. This is I, it's a total nasty, <laughs> dirty pickup truck. It is. Oh, I would love to see a pig back here. A pig? Just like, just. Yeah, an actual pig okay. in the bed of the truck. Okay. <laughs> that would actually, that would fit the theme. I don't know if I could fit one, but I could try and put one in there. Yeah. I don't know if he would sit still or not, but... Uh, no, that would actually be really cute. I, like I don't need to do that. Yeah. See? Look. Yeah. See, everybody has things they can add to stuff, you know? Give hey, yourself more credit. I helped! Yeah. I'm going to get a pig. <laughs> Pigs can help sell yeah, flowers. <laughs> This is good. And then maybe I am seeing, I mean, even my chats. Are, oh, yeah, there's your tail lights right there. there yeah. Let's go. I got a little redstone ones this time. I usually do glass. And I'm like, you know, I'm going to do the little boop, little boop lights, you know? <laughs> little, little kitty boop lights. <laughs> little boop lights. Little boop lights. And you can, I, I mean, love it. You can drive it. Just, it just, you don't need a steering wheel there, right? I would love to drive it. If this thing started, <laughs> you know, what's funny is that if it was like Etho or Tango that moved it, I'd be like 80% sure it actually drives. Oh my gosh. <laughs> if, if only I could make that actually do a thing, that would be so cool. Sadly, sadly not. It's just the setting. I love it. I Thank really you. do. 
Yeah. We're gonna sell. I'm gonna be right. selling flowers soon. So if you want any flowers, specifically all kinds of flowers, come here for your flowers. Ooh. Yeah, and dice. All right. mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Very good. Last per excusely suggestion. I've got myself a pick. I would say this little guy has to be the flower shop mascot. However, he doesn't really have a name. <laughs> He's got a settle, but he doesn't have a name. I'm just wondering if, you, if any of you guys have any ideas, do let me know down, down in the comments below. You know how terrible I am with naming things. I'm going to leave this one up to you guys. Hey, little buddy. You're adorable. Either way, pick aside, and of course, overall, I have built yet another vehicle that I do feel decently happy with. And of course, yet again, it's a truck. <laughs> There's just something about the trucks that just make them so very thoroughly enjoyable to build. But this time, of course, this one's more of a farm route truck with the kind of wagon part on the back of it. The back also comes out a little bit further than the wheels this time because a lot of the references I saw of these kind of like farm trucks had to the back kind of crate area just actually come out a decent chunk away from the back wheel. So I tried to kind of keep that kind of shape going within uh, Minecraft itself there as well. And in regards to the vehicles, I will openly admit now that I am enjoying building them more and more each day, and I actually do like the challenge they present. That's a big reason as to why I'm liking them so much. And each starter shop will be its own vehicle in time as well, so I'm definitely looking forward to seeing what I end up making for them. I just really hope I haven't dug myself a really big hole here. Oh boy. Also, one thing to note this time is that the permits for the shop are inside the vehicle. There were a few suggestions to uh, put the permit for that shop inside the front as well. And I think that is a fantastic idea. But for this one, I think the, uh, the permits actually just felt like they fit better inside the vehicle and just in general. Outside the vehicle didn't really match as much, so I decided to stick them inside instead. And you can come in here and take a bit of a gander at them if you want to. And of course, one permit is the small blossom permit and the other one is all the dyes and flowers. Now, since the clip as well, I've also done a little bit of a stock up. We now have a bunch of spore blossoms in here, of which are also one diamond for one blossom. Speaking of prices, this kind of thing is also open to suggestions. If you guys have a better suggestion of how this stuff should be priced, please do let me know, because it's kind of just an estimated guess at this point. A big test as well is if it sells. If it doesn't sell, I'll make it cheaper. If it sells too much, I'll make it more expensive. You know, that's just kind of how it's going to go. But this is the most valuable one, so it's got its own little armor stand deck decoration out the front here as a separate barrel. But inside the van itself, we have the dies on the right hand side. We got a stack of each, one diamond per stack, nice and cheap. We got two bunches of barrels with those dies. And then on the left hand side here, we have all of the flowers. We've got the kind of more valuable flowers that are a little bit harder to get, one diamond per 16. And then up here on this barrel, we've got the more common ones that are super easy to get, one diamond per stack for our pricing. So I think that should do just for now as a really good starter shop. Now, before I do move on though, I do want to mention the lovely banners here. We haven't really talked about these too much, but it's a lovely looking oxide daisy and it's absolutely fantastic. I cannot take the credit for this banner design, however. I would very much like to give a shout out to iCraft MC, who I actually found this flower banner pattern from, and I think it is pretty adorable and looks honestly fantastic with the truck. So I will chuck a uh, link to the video that I watched down in the description below so you guys can check it out yourself if you also want to make that banner. With the truck now on the server though and another shop down for our permits, it is actually time to yet again end the episode for today. This episode was definitely a bit more interaction heavy than productive, but I did have a lot of fun and I hope you all did too. So thank you very much for watching everyone. You all are amazing and I'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye everybody. Goodbye now. Goodbye. Boop. I heard that. <laughs> well, what's going on? <laughs> Carlos and I just have to keep having horn offs today, mate. This is the third time. I can't. I can't help it. I. I gotta be the last one to press the horn. Okay. It's important. <laughs> I was like stood here, just being like.
What is... I, I, is this a normal sound? Like, I don't think I've ever heard this before. It is I mean, today. I have heard it before. <laughs> it is very but... normal today. This very specific day, it's normal. <laughs> Where's Karanis then? Are you are you just are you just tooting at each other? Oh, he's at his base. It surprisingly reaches very very far. I was gonna say that's like some serious distance yeah. that you two have got. It really is. Every time I'm in the shopping district, we have to do it now. So it's an <laughs> obligation. Otherwise, he wins. You see. Wow. But this it, is excellent. Well, that one sounded global. <laughs> 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 Zed's just Zed's just out making fart jokes. <laughs> That's cool though. It's very didgery didgeridoo-y. It is. It is. It, it yeah. really throws me off at the end though. You know, like why did they decide to yeah. like? <laughs> they they went from using their mouth to turning around and using their buttocks, and I'm very confused. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It, <laughs> definitely, definitely goes from a dry sound to a slightly less dry sound. I think is the S slightly the less way dry sound. Apt description. <laughs> Apt description, sir. <laughs> yeah.